So here's the viaduct, which is a genuinely impressive structure. We've got off the train for a look around. There's a llama, like you do. Uh, lots of tat. <laughs> <laughs> Hand railing made out a train track, nice touch. God, they're thin. Got dizzy walking up those stairs. <sighs> Film crew still doing their thing. God, I can barely talk. So we are about four and a bit kilometers above sea level, I think. 4.22. The air is extremely thin. We uh, were walking up those stairs a second ago. I got proper out of breath. How about you? A bit. Yeah, and after the running I've been doing, you know, I thought my lungs would be more efficient. <laughs> well, there is a cold wind up here. So we just got back from the train to the clouds. It is, uh, what's that, half eleven? Yeah, so it's a long day, seven in the morning to eleven at night, but an amazing trip, amazing scenery. In case you're wondering how low the air pressure is at the top of the train to clouds, which is four kilometres above ground level, that's a bottle that we opened while we were up there. So this is what the air pressure difference is. Not as impressive as I'd hoped. Could have really done without the entertainment and being called up to individually receive a certificate at the end, though. That was a bit... Ugh. But all in all, amazing trip. And yeah, apologies for the length of this video. <laughs>